We're here in the ITU studio in Dubai in the United Arab Emirates and I'm very pleased to be joined by Louis Cassambra who is Vice Minister for the ICT Agency under the Department of Science and Technology of the Philippines. Vice Minister, thank you very much indeed for being with us today. Thank you for having me. I'd like to start off by talking about the recent typhoon in the Philippines, uh, which obviously highlighted the devastation and destruction caused by natural disasters. Telecommunication infrastructures are usually hit hard. What was your experience of this? Well, uh, our experience was that actually nothing, nothing was left. Everything was blown away. Uh, so there were actually a few days where we had no communication with with the areas affected. Yesterday in the meeting about connecting small island developing states, you talked about the benefits of satellite technology in disaster response. How do you think it can help? Well, uh, satellite technology does not, re uh, does not rely on any terrestrial infrastructure. So they are a great tool for first response. You know? uh, there are some considerations that we have to make. You know? Uh, in, after a severe weather event, not only is the communication infrastructure gone, but most likely the power, the utility power is also gone the same. So we have to address the fact that there will be prolonged periods where there is no alter, uh, uh, commercial power. So it's important to couple or put together satellite technology with alternative sources of energy. Now, you also suggested that a good solution following natural disasters is high-frequency radio, as television and telephones are often compromised. Can you tell us a little bit about your thoughts on this? I think in the age of the mobile phone, the cellular phone, um, a lot of us have already forgotten about HF radio. But you know, the, the, uh, the one thing that we were able to use after the typhoon was an HF radio. So we are now uh, looking to institutionalize it once again, especially since our country is uh, often hit by natural disasters. So I think it has a place as a last stop, uh, as a last stopgap measure you know, uh, when it comes to disaster response. What are your expectations for this conference? Well, we, we uh, hope to see that the, uh, that the ITU you know, uh, will continue to evolve as the uh, focal point for governance of international IT, uh, I, uh, ICTs. You know? uh, so we're here to participate you know, and uh, we, we hope to uh, see that happen. Vice Minister, thank you very much indeed for being with us today. Uh, you're most welcome, sir. And thank you very much for joining us here at the World Telecommunication Development Conference 2014.